Hello, welcome. Today we're going to be seeing how to translate strings from Moodis Controls plugin using another plugin called Loco Translate. So, what is Loco Translate? This is Loco Translate. So, this Loco Translate is a plugin, a free plugin which is available on WordPress, which is used to translate strings or plugins or themes, which is available on your WordPress site. Why do we actually go for this plugin? It's because it's very simple and it also has a built in translation editor. And you can just get into your WordPress dashboard directly and then start translating your plugins or themes from there. Okay, let's get started. All that you have to do is click on add new plugin and then search for this plugin. You'll be able to find it here. Click on install and activate the plugin on your dashboard on your WordPress site. Right? I have already done it. It's just ready. I'm just excited to show you today. After you install and activate your plugin, all that you have to do is navigate to local translate, click on plugins. Once you click on plugins, you'll be able to see the list of plugins available and you're going to be selecting which one you're going to translate today. So I'm going to be translating two strings, which is discount and free, which is coming from more discount rules plugin into a different language, right? So I'm going to be selecting that plugin here, more discount rules pro 2.0. As you can see, there's no translation file found because I'm starting from the scratch. So if you're starting from the scratch, the first step that you have to do is click on new language. This is the first step. Make sure you select the default language. So here it is, English, United States. The second step is to choose a location. It is suggested to select system, the second option. And the third step is to select start translating. Nice. So if you already find a translation file there, you probably have to skip this step. But if you're starting from the scratch, then this is recommended. Nice. So now you'll be able to find the string that you're trying to translate. So if you really do not have time to just go through everything, you can just search the particular string. Once you search it, you find it, click on it. So your source text for translation is discount. Now you can enter the translation, the actual translated text. So I'm going to be entering it to this one, right? Okay, so the next step is once you enter this translated string, you'll have to just go and save it. Yes. So on clicking on save, you'll be able to see that it's successfully translated by refreshing your page. Now you'll be able to see that the string discount is translated to another language. Success. Now next we're going to be translating this string called free. All that you have to do is again go to local translate and plugins and click on the selective plugin, which is who discount rules pro. Now you will be able to see a translation file there, which is in progress. So sometimes some strings won't be available in that list. So all that you're going to do is add the string to the list and then start translating. So we are going to be adding this string called free first. So for that, you need to click on edit template. Once you click on edit template, you will have to yes, simply add the text, which is not there. I have already added it, but I'm just showing you. Click on add and then add the text by entering here. You need to enter the text here. Yes, free. And then save it. Nice. So once you enter the text and save it, you'll have to again come back to plugins. Yeah. And you can just edit the translation file and start translating the text. Now, once you have added that string, you'll be able to find the string here. Alrighty, right, yes. So string is added successfully now because you can see it in the list and now it's time to enter the translated text. Yes, so this is my translation. Now we're going to be clicking on save and then go to your page and refresh it. Now you'll be able to see that the word free is translated to a different language. So make sure that if you do not find the string that you're looking for in that list, you'll have to first add them and then translate them. Simple. I hope you really understood. And it's a simple way of translating strings from our plugin. Hope you like it. Thank you.